keister. Shove it in your keister. Yeah, we're... <laughs> Hey friends, you probably can't freaking see me right now, but I did not have time to vlog at home. I wanted to do a whole like get ready with me. I was rushing, so I'm here to meet my sister at this place called The Lincoln in Venice, Marina del Rey, Venice. I think it's Venice. Yeah, and I got here like five minutes ago. I think she just got here, so I'm excited. I might not vlog just because, I don't know. Maybe I will. Maybe I will, you guys seem to like her. My top has like, buckles on it. Love Dolls Kill and it's like super high cut. You guys can't see shit. It's dark as fuck. Actually, maybe I noticed it when I This is my job. Can you see me? in my stomach right now. I have like gas pains, but also like, I don't know, my, my stomach just feels, it's felt fucked up for the past like almost week. By the way, I just got my nails done. That's where I just came from. They are chrome. I sounded like Oprah. I wanted coffin shaped. I feel like these are a little bit more square than coffin, but that's okay. She took like three hours on them, so she took her damn time. I also have not updated you guys, I don't think, since last night when I was with my sister. So I'm gonna film a Patreon video on like what really happened last night, but I'll give you the quick rundown. I have a lot of funny added details for my Patreon. I'm telling you, my life is a movie every time I go out and do shit, or a TV show, rather, I guess. The only reason I got them done, actually, is because when I got home last, well, I guess this morning, it was literally like 4 a.m. I was eating popcorn, and I put like a bunch of stuff on it, like I always do, like I put nutritional yeast and like salt and garlic salt. I'm a salty bitch, and every time I would put my hand in my bowl, which it pretty much just lives in there when you're eating popcorn and you're shoving it in your face. My fingers would be burning so badly, I like couldn't handle it. I was about to like f try and find like a rubber glove or like a, yeah, like a cleaning glove just to eat popcorn. And then I was like, that's gross. I don't want to do that. Yeah, it's because since I ripped my acrylics off, well, I ripped off what was left of them. My nails were like literally gone and getting them done hurt super bad, but I have much to update you guys on later. Okay, hello. I just did a 45 minute Patreon, so I'm like, gonna keep this short. But basically, I was supposed to be driving home today. Well, I, I would have been home by now. But at like 3 a.m. when I was editing, I was like, you know, I'm probably not gonna leave at 6 a.m. to drive for seven hours. So then I was like, okay, I'll just drive at night. I've been sick today, and I was a little sick yesterday too, but I just thought I was hungover. It continued to today. I literally have the chills. Um, so then I was like, okay, I told my mom I would go tomorrow. So the plan as of now is to drive tomorrow morning. Only thing is 
it's going to be a very, very, very short trip because I'm going to come back on Monday morning. But I wanted to be home for Easter unless I feel like this tomorrow. Oh, I have goosebumps. Good. Don't know if you can even see me, but I'm home and I'm laying on my floor. Hey. You can probably hear bug purring. Don't you know? I just feel like shit. Like absolute shit. Stop, honey. So yeah, I don't feel good. Definitely not driving home tonight. I have a list of stuff that I wanted to get done tonight and god I feel so bad. I talked about it in my Patreon video why I'm feeling like this. I don't think I'm sick. I think it's a different reason. I don't feel like getting into that again. I got another package from Doll's Kill when I got home. Came home to a package from Doll's Kill and then another package which I don't know. Hold please, let me feed her so she stops screaming. Hey, don't you know that I'm about to feed you? Was that just not recording or I don't know what just happened but my camera just turned off. Great, whatever, not gonna re-say all of that stuff. Yesterday was the day that I was like laying on the floor really not feeling good. I was like, the plan is to go home tomorrow. Um, that didn't happen and I'm really sad about it. My mom sent me pictures of her and my dad and my brother-in-law and my nieces at the Easter egg hunt and I was just really sad. But my sister Jess isn't gonna go. So tomorrow on Easter, we're gonna go to brunch at this really nice um, like rooftop restaurant with a bunch of people and that'll be fun. So. Did I just get a package? Um. I woke up at 11 a.m. I don't know when the last time was that I did that. I mean, I did go to sleep at like 3, but that's like 8 hours of sleep right there. That's like unheard of for me. I'm still feeling like kind of off and kind of like, oh. But I did get another package from Doll's Kill yesterday, which I think I showed you guys. It's 420, y'all. Happy fucking 420. I'm definitely going to be getting lit tonight. I don't know what to do. I have like three videos in mind that I really want to film also. I just... I wish I was feeling like a little bit better, like a little bit more energy, and I just don't love filming in my apartment. It's small, the lighting isn't great. It's loud outside, you can probably hear. It sounds like a giant vacuum, I don't know what that is. I don't know, but I did finally hang up the mirror. It's up there. I took down my two LED lights. See, so yeah, I just have all like white lights in here right now. Love that about it. I like that about myself. But I, do, I still feel like I need like an overhead light because this vlog is gonna be so annoying to edit for me because I'm just like so slow that I'm just like, there's so many just pauses and. Yep, can't confirm. This is super, super annoying to edit. Let me show, ow! Do you guys like my shirt by the way? I feel like Zach Morris. Anyway, I wanna show you guys these two glasses. Sunglasses that I don't have. And I've been looking for more of these. I've always thought they were really cute, but I didn't think they would look good on me. I just never really think sunglasses look good on me, though. I don't know. I don't know what it is. Maybe it's because, like, the only thing that I like about my face is my eyes. And so then, like, it's basically, like, just fucking covering up the only thing that I like about my face. And I didn't try them on. I just grabbed them. I tried them on this morning after I got ready. And I was like, I kind of like these. So these ones are just black. And everyone just, like, wears them at the bottom of their nose. Like, no one wears them normally. That actually does look kind of crazy and dumb if you wear them like this. <laughs> I don't know, I'm looking at myself in the screen and I don't like it, but when I looked in the mirror, I was like, oh, I really like these, but isn't that how it always goes? And then these ones, I really like these. These kind of go with my top. What do y'all think about the small glasses trend? 
or whatever it is. I still love giant oversized glasses. Yeah, I just think they look weird when you when you wear them like, like they should be. But also, I don't know if you're supposed to wear them like this because literally they're not blocking. Like they're so small, they don't even block all of the light from my eyes. So definitely more of a fashion statement. That's for sure. I don't know. I guess I'll do a little unboxing since I'm gonna open this stuff anyway. I need scissors. I don't know why it seems dark in here because I have been adding lights. Maybe because my kitchen and bathroom light are turned off. That's probably why actually. Let's see what this is. Nothing that I ordered. Oh, it's from Garden Grove. Isn't that like super close to me? It came from Quick Sonic, spelled really weirdly. And I don't know how I'm on any PR. I told like everyone that I changed besides Dolls Club, that's not PR, but I told like every company that I was on a PR list, like take my address off the list and I'll give you my new address when I move. So I didn't get a boxy charm this month and I was really sad about it. Like you know what's crazy? I just realized it's April 20th and I got out of treatment on April 20th, 2017. I don't know if you've noticed, Bug has been around this video. Still don't know what it is, but this is what it looks like. Should take it out of the bag so it's not reflecting. Bliss Advanced Sonic Facial Device. Rechargeable. Oh, is this like the same brand as Clarisonic? Okay, this packaging though, this is like pleather. It's like very nice. Zoe Bliss. This is exciting because I don't know what the hell this is. Oh, this looks like a sex toy kind of. Whoa. Whoa. So you would expect that to be like, okay, sorry, this is like really crazy. This is what it looks like. Zoe, quick Sonic. Ow, bug. She's been doing this thing where she like latches onto my flesh and literally like bites it so fucking hard. It's like she knows she's like trying to hurt me. I think she's just teething. Did I just, do I look more yellow than I did before? What's going on here? All right, on to the Dolls Kill package. Oh, yeah, they sent this priority one day. Because I was going to say, I literally got the email about Rolling Loud and then an email about Stagecoach on Wednesday. <laughs> Wait, what day is it? It's Saturday. Okay, so I got the email on Thursday. Got back to her on Thursday night. And I got this package yesterday, which was Friday. So, oh, damn. I think she put everything in this box. Wow, yeah, this is so crazy because I literally picked these boots out a day ago and they came yesterday. But it looks like she also put clothes in here because it's like super full and taped shut. Okay, so this is the stagecoach package. These are fucking chaps and they're not assless chaps, though I know that's like a huge trend right now. I didn't want assless chaps. Look at these. They're like cut out on the thigh, but then they're lace up. Oh wait, this is the front. The zipper's in the front and then they lace up the front. Oh, I think you can unsnap these too. That's funny. Oh my gosh, these are so cute. These are jean shorts. These are the Horoscopes brand, which I really, really like. I can't wait for it to be Libra season so I can actually get my own stuff because they come out with stuff like every season. So they just came out with Taurus stuff. It's officially Taurus season. Kind of sad about it because I really like Aries season. The jean shorts. There's a rose patch, a butterfly patch. This is whatever. And then the back is like... This is a top. And I believe I got this to go with shorts or it could go with the pants too it's just this bandana top and then it ties in the back and this is from their club x brand i got this adorable jacket cropped jacket it's fringy oh my gosh it has shoulder pads yes i have the puniest shoulders ever oh for either i mean really you could wear all of these things together um these are going to be in my try on so if i'm doing a bad job of showing them or it's kind of hard to show clothes without wearing them but they look like this vinyl i'm obsessed with booties lately because i've been going out more at night being single to school i was always like i don't have any freaking shoes that i can wear i don't want to wear like stiletto heels and i also don't want to wear like adidas or puma sneakers like i had no in between my camera overheated and then i went outside to check if i had a package and bitch did i have a package because it's the biggest one it's in their big daddy box flame pants bitch each sign has a bunch of clothes that go with it, and I'm pretty sure these were Aries. Flared, high-waisted pants, but they're kind of like cropped. But these look so cute with boots. But these are jean, oh, Jesus, my eye. Jean cargo pants, they're high-rise. They have like zippered pockets, zippered down here. These are so cute. That is everything. Oh my gosh. And by the way, this is not sponsored. They didn't ask me to unbox this on camera. They don't even ask me to do anything on YouTube. It's an Instagram thing. It's Easter, y'all. I'm sweating because I was just outside taking out trash. I leave for five minutes to take out trash, come back, and she acts like I've been gone for two weeks. Hey, bub. Hi, bub. I don't look like myself. There you go. You can still be you and be like, have a little bit less accessory happening. That's not what I mean, though. Mm -hmm. It's just 
just like the white frilly. Oh. So I just don't wear this ever. It's still showing skin though. It's showing, not like I always show skin. I usually was white. I usually wear baggy t-shirts and leggings every day. Hi, hello friends. It is Easter. Happy Easter. Is there an Easter song? Easter Here comes Peter Cottontail. You know that one? <coughs> Ooh, a yellow plane. Oh, it's spirit. She looks like a girl. I look like John Lennon. Oh wait, he wears brown glasses. We're going to Venice again. We literally were at Venice earlier in this vlog, actually. Earlier in this vlog is when we were at Venice. Oh! And now we're going again, oh. but during the daytime. Easter schmeaster. Shove it in your keister. Yeah, we're, <laughs> we're not rebelling, we're just being us. Well, we're not there, so we did our own Easter. I have nothing to say, but this vlog <laughs> is lacking. What? I have nothing to say either. Not like you were asking me to say something, but... Okay. <laughs> I wanted to do a boomerang. It's funny because I don't even realize the things that you say until I'm editing. <laughs> Guys, thumbs up this video if we should do turning my sister into me. Or turning you into me. <laughs> or turning, or, yeah. You have to wear these glasses like down on your nose, otherwise it looks stupid. It's terrifying. <laughs> my ears are crooked. Actually, they're not crooked, fun fact. This side of my face is higher than this side. And now that I've noticed that, I can't unsee it, but I don't care. I mean, I feel like we have a good chance had to go camping so much as we'll be fine. Everyone that I ask if they, have, they like camping, they'll be like, I've never been camping. And I'm like, you didn't go as like a kid? And they're like, no. And I'm like, I literally have probably gone camping 200 times. More than that. You're probably not gonna be able to hear any of this <laughs> music the whole time. Okay guys, um, I was gonna update you before I left here so that I could vlog in my apartment and not from my car, but I just gave Bug her treats, which means that I gotta sneak out before she finishes. I guess we will chat in the car. I'm actually gonna end this vlog because, wow. I just spent an hour doing a story time for my Patreon about yesterday, this weekend, um, being drugged, running into a booty call that I told I was out of town. It's It was literally so much happened this weekend. I, I didn't even like, I didn't even get to all of it because there was so much that happened. <sighs> Maybe tonight I will start filming. I wanna do a story time on everything because I still need to do my date story time and that is, very much tied to what happened this weekend and also last week. Everything's all tied together and I want to make a story time and it's probably going to be like two or three parts which I was planning on starting today but I feel like absolute shit. Like I just spent a long time talking about it so I'm not going to get too much into it but I wasn't feeling good earlier in this video. Yesterday which was Easter I woke up and I was feeling a lot better. I was like okay I must have had a bug or something whatever. Yesterday surprise surprise <sighs> pretty sure I was roofied. It was like dealing with that yesterday. But today, I'm back to feeling how I was feeling before Easter when I was feeling like sick and nauseous and like spinny and just like terrible. And I don't know if it's because like uh, if from yesterday, from being drugged and everything, or if it's like a relapse of whatever weird bug illness. I, I don't know, like it's freaking me out why I'm still feeling like this. Um. So, I'm sorry, I'm super out of it, if you can't tell. I'm spinning, I'm nauseous, I'm exhausted. My stomach, I just have like that feeling in my stomach, like almost like kind of like the stomach flu, but also like my appetite hasn't gone away. I don't know, it's super bizarre. I don't know what's going on. I thought it was cause like I was ovulating and then like, I don't know. If you're curious about all of that, go to my freaking Patreon cause I've just <laughs> ranting over there. Honestly, the story that I just told for Patreon, this is not like a promo, but my heart is still racing because I just, I. I can't believe all of the things that happened yesterday. <laughs> all I know is I do want to get up this vlog because it's Monday and I started it on Wednesday, last Wednesday. So I'm ending it right now. The next video you see will either be part one of the story time or it may be my try on haul if I can get that done. I was planning on filming it this weekend, but I didn't end up going home. Why do I even try? I don't know, but I'm wearing a Britney Spears shirt. You see it? Hi, bitch. I am just very out of it. Like, I literally want to bring my sunglasses inside because my eyes are just so... Everything's spinning, my eyes hurt. It's like, I don't know what's going on. I'm just over it, you know? I'm just over it. Uh, okay, thanks for watching. Subscribe. I need my money. <laughs> Relax for a minute and let me just begin to tell you about how I feel about women wearing Chanel when I smell you. It's incredible. And I've been waiting for you like a long time. Feel like a lifetime. Tonight feel like the right time.